nigga, I swear to God, we like five deep in this white bitch truck, yeah. Punch some Dracos up out the window and get the light shit up, yeah. And I'ma keep running cause my P.O. really got life fucked up, uh, And I ain't no rapper when you see me, it's bitch, your eyes be tough. What's up, y'all? Oops, hold on. This is what I'm doing. Cause they females, so they try to make it like one more fuck, fuck one more fuck hard, they try to... It be all type of shit. But it ain't nothing. Was it not on? No, it's not on. Hi. Hold on. This is what I'm doing. Had with Vaughn, there is also the fact that King Vaughn... Of course I'm on YouTube. What do you think? Damn. And Quando, he's an NBA representative. Quando Rondo is a member of the Never Broke Again crew and a close friend of YB. And we all know that Quando might get in trouble if he goes back to Chicago because of what happened in 2020. Even though his little homie Lil Pad got smoked, Quando Rondo is still a target. Remember, there was no real retaliation for the hit on Bond, and as harsh as it may sound, we might see it happen one day. But the comment about Chicago being a dangerous place did not affect YB's manager a single bit. He replied with, we be in that bitch first. I do not own any rides, fair use act in place. A lot of people so, think that if chill. the tour could actually drop by Chicago, Please, a lot no of folks think it wouldn't even be possible from a formal point of view. It's a legit threat to security and everybody's safe. This is just a PR move. The manager knows damn well the show will be canceled by police or higher ups last minute or close to the show's date once threats come in. It hypes up the rest of YB's tour and they for sure won't be allowed yeah. to do shows anywhere where things can pop off. I guarantee the mayor shut that down before That's it even good. happened. Not sure if YB be going to come prepared with security D. He's coming to prove a point. I think Bobby, it's all crazy. Uh, it's coming to kill you. Losing your life over or jeopardizing anyone else's. Praying it don't happen. Then again, there are those who love to bang out to his music. Some of those most devoted fans are from Chicago, and they want to see him perform there. Why be going to have some sold out shows? He's going to perform one day. But right Hoping now, no. He's still songs. got court That'll shit. That'll be dope. Fire. I'm rooting for you, brother. If you take a look at YB's official webpage, you can see that the tour dates are still not published, which my husband was talking about any information like, about the tour and whether or not it's really going to take uh, place. Regardless, there are some OTF affiliates who took him. notice of the possibility of YB dropping to Chicago for a show, and as you can already suspect, they're not liking it a single bit. As a matter of fact, one of the guys who goes by the name of OTF Varney says NBA Youngboy and Quando Rondo will not be leaving Chicago if they arrive for their show. That's a lie. Varney That's a motherfucking lie. His homies, and he commented on the rumors of the tour, he said this. Hey, 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 PSA, 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 man, look. I, 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 I PSA, 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 man, yeah. look. I bet you, Shut up. I bet, hey, listen, I bet you all types Ain't shit gonna like, ever happen. If YB and Quando come to a show, they ex is not leaving Scotland. Yeah. They're gonna cancel that picture before they. A mouth will say anything. Now, for those of y'all who don't know Vernon, a mouth will say anything. He always had Dirk's back. A lot of folks from Shot Town find him to be Dirk's muscle. However, the people on the internet, they why, why be that's better? scary. And then he's certainly not someone who could pose a threat to NBA young boy or even Quando Rondo. Part of the reason why they're saying this is because he's in a wheelchair. And the other is because he's known to be sending all kinds of threats and nothing ever happened. All bark, no bite, bro. As you can clearly yeah, tell, yeah, there's yeah, a lot of tension in the air. If YB does the show in Chicago, it's going to be something else. Yeah, shot out that motherfucking wheelchair. That yeah. stuff is going to be different from any anyone we see before. Part of the reason why the tensions are so high is not just because of the King Vaughn sitch. Things have been stirring between Dirk and NBA Youngboy too. Ever since YB just the whole rap game with his I Hate Youngboy track, things just ain't been the same. Remember why he's Dirk's on He uh, said, how you talking shit on. nothing ain't died about your cousin him. Quando got no filter and he say that they gon' with him. Clean up on I.O. Young and let that chop blow and my brother let that stick blow. Those are direct threats to the entire O Block, including Little Dark. He let all them boys know that if they step on there, it, there. it's war. A lot of folks like TF and the NBA crew who could be straight up enemies even before the tracks. But performing on enemy turf, that's nothing but asking for trouble. Things can only get ugly if that happens. Some folks who just want to see all the rappers survive and make more music pray that their tour never happens. Others think that the show could easily take place since the security on the NBA team is going to be hella tight. There ain't yeah. no way I know they would I... ever let anything happen to YB and Quando. At this time, we still don't know 
know what's going to happen with the YB tour, but if it does take place, we got to keep an eye on to see if Chicago is going to be on the map. If it does, we I'll might see all kinds come of things coming our shit. way. But what are y'all thoughts on this whole situation? Is YB going to be performing in Chicago? Do you think he and Kwando will be dropping by Chicago? And if so, are they going to be in any kind of danger? Let us know what your take is on the whole situation in the comments Zero. section below. As always, remember to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you found this video interesting, then you got to check this next one out too. Thank Shout you so much out for watching. Stay tuned to our channel. And as always, remember to keep it real. Shout out to Jay and uh, YB will be fine. Why be better? And people get to choose to believe with they got two sides. Now they got my side, which they know is telling the truth, not hating. But then this? they got people that tell their lies for clout chasing. You know what I'm saying? So now common sense got to kick in. What's good, what's good, what's good? Uh -huh.